another Yoruba priestess, once said that Nollywood has, in a way, helped to bring down the value of our tradition, especially religious tradition, because the perception is anything now that is bad is either a juju priest or, uh, or one anything evil yes. has to be these people. Uh, so has Nollywood played a role in that? No, to I, a degree? I, I agree. I mean, yes, yes, because um, there's a lot of misrepresentation. Mm. In, I mean, through our films mm. and misinterpretation mm. through our films. You know, you don't, when you go to a Babalao, for example, if you even mention Babalao anywhere, uh, to start everybody with. will run and they'll be <laughs> yeah. like, ah, well, <laughs> you know, but Babalao does not, uh, Babalao would not see you and say, oh, okay, oh, oh, makulola, oh in your conch. No, they don't, they don't do that. People need to understand the difference between. The Babalao, the Onishegu, and yeah, the Adaunshe, yeah. you know, and not, if I is knowledge, I try to understand the different religion so I can strike a balance. Mm. And so that when people are talking, I can say, look, I know this is not what it is. Mm. Even if I don't practice it, I have a clear understanding of war runs. Most of our films, you know, the way uh, uh, the shrine is presented, uh, the way uh, most of the priests and the Babalaos are presented. No, it's, it's to a lot is misrepresentation. Yeah. And even some of the uh, chants yeah. and the Odu. And the use they, of those And chants. the use of those, use, have, they are misused. So when you see a proper Babalao, you know, most times they're like, no, come on, you, you know, you don't do this. And the same way you have misrepresentation in, in, in Christianity, you have in Islam, yes. and you are also have in Yoruba traditional belief. But I feel that to a large extent, some of us who feel the need or who also see the need uh, to do the right thing mm -hmm. will always use our platform. I try to understand the different religion so I can strike a balance. Mm -hmm. And so that when people are talking, I can say, look, I know this is not what it is. Mm -hmm. Even if I don't practice it, I have a clear understanding of war runs. Most of our films, you know, the way uh, uh, the shrine is presented, uh, the way uh, most of the priests and the Babalaos are presented. No, it's, it's to a lot is misrepresentation. Yeah. And even some of the uh, chants yeah. and the Odu. And the use they, of those And chants. the use of those, use have, they are misused. So when you see a proper Babalao, you know, most times they'll be like, no, come on, you, you know, you don't do this. And the same way you have misrepresentation in, in, in Christianity, you have in Islam, yes. and you are also having Yoruba traditional belief. But I feel that to a large extent, some of us who feel the need or who also see the need uh, to do the right thing mm. will always use our platform. There are like 100 people in that garage okay. working. So it's, a, well, it's a proper garage? No, yeah, no, it's yeah. a proper garage. You have upholsters, you have rewires, you have painters, okay. you have panel beaters. So it's not just your side, side, no, 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 side uh, not. roadside but mechanic. But it's the core raw mechanic workshop. Okay. So when, so, but when I went to pick him later, because I, I told him I'll come and pick you at four. When I got there, it was that video I posted. That was what he was doing. Okay. And I said, okay, well, yeah, let's go. And he said, uh, can I finish <laughs> this what I'm doing? I'm doing? <laughs> so I had to, st I said, oh, great. So I had to stay another one hour. And before you know it, they started calling him engineers. And every morning, it would be the one that would say, oh, well, they're doing environmental in the workshop today. So I we'll have to get the early and all of that. And it will tell you about parts, you know, car parts. And number 12, I'm, number 14, I'm number I'm telling 16. you, so it's just, so this story, people will, will really uh, connect with the story. 80% of people with um, certificates from universities mm -hmm. or high institutions yeah. end up doing not what Absolutely. they want Absolutely, mm. absolutely. But education still has a role to play. No, it's key. Mm. And you s even in that film, mm. um, even though we all embrace the fact that you have to, at the end of the day, uh, the guy, well, I'm not going to give much You don't want to give too really, much away. It's important that you have your education. What is education? Education is still part of this thing you're learning. But formal education, to be able exactly. to interact, to be able to read and write, mm -hmm. and to have a clear understanding okay. of what you you are cut out to do, mm. that, for me, is education. Very, very, and that's and essential. Very, that's very key. Ira is my signature, and that can accommodate more collections. Exactly, yeah. So then I registered. Ire being the name of your uh, every, my house, my dog, yeah. my congrats on the Akwe Womo. <laughs> <Aqua Womo. laughs> <laughs> that know, cracked me and, up. And it's like you know, the, the, there's something strong about you know Yoruba will say Akwe Mora language. Many, many, true. There's something about claiming 
Ownership. Ownership. And there's something good about you because when you say Ire, you are you are literally praying. Yes. You know. So when you say Ire, you know, Ire even my car is Ire. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like claiming all the goodness mm. that comes with life. Mm. And that has really worked for me. You know. So we now register the company. We change the Instagram page to Ire Clothings, and now we have like five collections. And this is exclusive. This is you are seeing this here for the first time Eric ever. Trench coat in sub zero degrees London <laughs> yes, weather. <so> <laughs>